Okay, so we're going to quickly talk about how to fix the tuning on one of these little bent sopranos. This one's a Lade, I bought it from China. So what's happening is when you get to the upper octave and you're always wondering why my G is in tune, but when I go to an A, it's way sharp. What's actually happening, and let's watch up here, down, up, G, A. This one opens up when you hit the A on the upper octave. What's actually happening is the hole in there is just far too big. So it's acting like a tone hole. It's not acting like an octave key trigger. It needs to be you know, a millimetre across, not three and a half millimetres, which this one was. So I've just got a picture here on my phone. And you can see the mod I made was to take a piece of plastic. It was, in fact, an inside of a pen, uh, modelled it up and just shoved it in there and shaved it off so that I now have a hole that's got to be one fifth of the original diameter. And that's enough to stop these little guys from being way out of tune when you go GA to being almost perfect. So now the thing is for 250 bucks, a really good little horn um, and you're not going to suffer that tuning problem. Maybe a lot of these instruments do the same thing. These octave holes, they just didn't make that small enough. If you get an oboe, it's like the size of a pin. So you could probably go a lot smaller than that, still get an octave. It's going to hold that tuning up all the way right up to your F sharp. The thing's going to sound great. So really easy mod little light pack for your sax and uh, makes these little $250 horns absolutely superb if you just want to use it occasionally.